Hello my fellow Smugwans, I hope you're all okay. Well once again those sneaky scammers have come up with a new way to separate us from our money. But don't worry because the banks are warning everyone to keep their eyes peeled when withdrawing cash. Because not doing so could actually cost you a lot of money. Let's begin. Okay, now this story is from the Daily Express and it says urgent warning issued by UK's biggest banks and ignoring it could be very costly. The scam apparently targets ATMs capable of withdrawing and depositing funds, which are often found outside of high street bank branches. Okay, well, let's see how this works. Scam artists place a printout next to the hole in the wall, warning customers that the deposit feature is out of order. I'm guessing it's probably, you know, one of those dodgy looking typed up notes in one of those plastic wallet looking things. Next up, they fit plastic in front of the drawer used for withdrawals to block the notes from protruding. Now, when the customer puts their card into the machine, enters their PIN, and then selects the amount of money they want to withdraw, they'll hear the whirring sound inside the ATM, but nothing will appear. With the plastic shield blocking the withdrawals, customers will look at the other drawer, you know, the one used for the deposits, despite what the homemade sign beside the cash machine claims. With nothing appearing, customers will wrongly assume that the cash machine is out of money or at a service or something has gone away with their account. And once the customer walks away from the cash machine, the criminal approaches the machine, prizes open the plastic cover and scoops the crumpled cash notes hidden behind it. It's not until the customer checks their statement that they realize their ATM was working as expected and that someone else has walked off with the money they needed. You know, I could be wrong, but I'm guessing this probably happens after the banks are closed because surely people would then go into the bank and stop a member of staff and say something like, where the hell is my moolah? Or something like that, and thereby exposing the scam. Fortunately though, I'm pretty sure that nearly all ATMs have CCTV fitted, so they'll hopefully get an image of the crooks for the police, unless of course, they're wearing some sort of disguise, I guess. The main thing to remember though, is that cash machines that have the ability for you to be able to deposit cash or checks have two drawers, one for depositing and one for dispensing. Although, to be honest, if you do see some sort of typed up note stuck next to the cash machine, it's probably best to just use another one anyway, isn't it? 